Hey guys, what is up? It is SSD Middleman here with Guides for Us All, and today we're going to be checking out the unique weapon December's Child in the Fallout 4 DLC, Far Harbor. Now to get December's Child, make your way inside the Vim Pop Factory and find the room with two big vats in it. Use the elevator in the corner to make your way down into a secret room. You'll have to talk to an AI named KYE 1.1 and convince him to let you inside the room. Once he does, you'll find December's Child in the back of the room. Make sure you grab December's Child on this visit because once you return, it will be locked and you'll be unable to get the weapon again. December's Child is a unique combat rifle with the unique effect of lighter and uses 5.56 ammo, 25% faster faster fire rate and 15% faster reload, but not really, and we'll talk about this in a moment. Now in the modding department, it's the same as any other combat rifle, you can swap out the receiver, barrel, stock, magazine, sight, and muzzle. Since it's a combat rifle, you'll want to be accurate and deal as much damage as possible in my personal opinion. Now December's Child performs well in combat due to the fact that it is a combat rifle, but it suffers from one detestable flaw. The unique effect doesn't work! That's right, the unique effect states that the weapon is lighter. It's not. It weighs the exact same as a regular combat rifle. It also implies that by using 5.56 ammo it will deal more damage. It doesn't. The only true thing about the weapon's unique effect is the faster fire rate and faster reload, making the weapon only truly possess the rapid legendary effect. The even bigger problem with this is that the weapon using 5.56 ammo gives it no advantages. In fact, it gives it a huge disadvantage. 5.56 ammo is even harder to come by than the standard 45 rounds that other combat rifles use, and you gain nothing by using them. This weapon could have been a much more powerful combat rifle with an interesting effect, however, due to this huge problem it's now really nothing to write home about i hope that bethesda patches this and makes this weapon somewhat usable anyways thanks for watching the video guys if you enjoyed please leave a like rating down below and subscribe to see some more videos in the future for updates on videos and other strange posts make sure to follow me on facebook and twitter at guides for us all i'll see you guys next time goodbye